welcome back to the vlog and welcome to vlogmas day 10 hello from me and my miss remy ashton unbothered and cozy merch i feel like i kind of stay bothered but I am quite cozy. This morning I went to the gym and then afterwards I got my booster shot. So then I strategically came home and washed and blow dried my hair because I have a strong inkling that I'm gonna be a little bit sore tomorrow in my left arm. I feel like I can feel it getting a little tender already. My last boosters, I didn't have any side effects so I don't anticipate going down tonight, but I wanted to hold my arms above my head for hair washing and blow drying. I feel like I've got a little countdown going to when this arm will just be like a chore to use. So I want to get some Christmas decorations up before that happens. I feel like I've been talking about the stairs garland for at least two vlogs now. So I want to get those up. I also got more ornaments to hang on the back of the tree. I gotta find a way to not have the back of the tree up against the mirror because it just exposes me. Christmas 2023, we're gonna find a solution for that. But anyways, let's put the garland up. I've got four of these taken out of the packaging and one more as a backup. Pretty cute though. They've also got the little firefly lights like already wrapped and entangled in each of the garlands. They do require like 14 billion batteries. So I'm gonna hang them first. This just feels like a lot to like have to go and hit four of these after putting three batteries in each pack. And they're really cute to begin with. These are from Amazon. So I'll throw the link in the description. Kind of overpriced, gonna be honest. But hopefully they'll last me many seasons because they're pretty cute. Garlanded. I am losing my mind because, okay, there's 16 of these little like pole thingies in between the main ones here, but some of them have two on each step and then some others have one. And so it was really throwing me off. And so there's definitely a few little like spacing tweaks that I can make, but also the angle that I shot a lot of that at make it look janky as hell. So anyways, Christmas, welcome. You are here <laughs> when you walk in the front door. Oh my God. I don't know why that ended up being so much more difficult than it needed to be. I kind of like it just without the lights. I just feel like adding four sets of three batteries just feels like a lot. All right. Well, I'm, uh, I'm going to call it there. Next up, we've got the tree. I also just realized that I'm officially done filming up in the DIY room and there's a ton of cute decor down there. Maybe not today, but at some point this week before my family gets here next week, I've got like a really cute little skinny tree and there's definitely since we're gonna do like a full Christmas dinner I definitely can like bring the skinny tree down here it'll be super cute in the meantime here is the little mini pack of ornaments that I ordered to go on the back of the tree and I'm like actually stupid this has happened to me so many times at this point where I don't spend quite enough time in the description and the details and the measurements of a product that I'm buying and so I definitely thought that these were full-size ornaments they're not they're quite adorable and small did not intend for them to be this small. So anyways, <sighs> just the consequences of my own actions. Okay, so anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna toss some of these up on the back. They really do match the color scheme quite well. God, I just never learn. I really don't. Totally forgot that at 5 p.m. our tree just automatically comes. 4.45, our tree automatically turns on. That scared the shit out of me. Ghost of Christmas, so you know what? I'm gonna take that as a sign. I can finally put the stockings up. I showed you guys these last vlog, but these are the most fragile stocking hangers in the world. Yes, they're cute, but like not worth the hassle whatsoever. I've been waiting forever to put these up. 
I mean, they are quite cute, actually. They're quite cute. that my table runner never showed up. There's also definitely a possibility that I did not hit order. I really had a box that I fully forgot about that was just like, had the garlands in it. And it had these adorable little placemats. So cute. I'll make sure to link these. They're like plasticky, definitely reusable, and definitely could like wipe these down, which is the main thing um, that I really wanted because I'm not the cleanest eater. This is the new little centerpiece. Chances that we lose a cranberry are quite high, I'd say. Oh, quite adorable. My hands are so cut up. I feel like I've got like little micro scratches everywhere. Okay, so she could use a little bit of floofing. She looks like she's uh, been through some shit. Oh, it's so cute, it's a little sleigh. I love when I order things and forget what I ordered. It's like a whole new surprise all over again. A pine cone. That was like a surprise pine cone. And then I got three flameless red candles. So sorry if you hate styrofoam. I promise, I swear to God, I'm trying to do this as fast as possible. No, no, did I fuck this up again? Oh. <laughs> if it ain't the consequences of my own actions again. These are like a centimeter too big. Oh my God, this is hilarious. What if I take the little wrapper off? <laughs> I kind of thought this was just like a standard size situation. Surprise. It's not. <laughs> you see what I was going for though, right? Like it's gonna be cute once I um, order the proper candles. In preparation to feel potentially, pro I mean realistically, I didn't have any like booster symptoms last time, so I probably won't this time either. But like, was this a little bit of an excuse to get a massive bowl of ramen? The answer is absolutely yes. <laughs> Rami time! Jeremy got some extra. Oh God. Jeremy got some extra noodles. So it looks like we've got three. Whoa. Okay, this is Jeremy's. We've got noodles, corn. Jeremy what? This is Jeremy's nudes, free nudes. Extra pork. Love that we both have zero green things in our ramen. And then I got the exact same thing except for just like regular pork. And then also some crispy onion bits. <gasps> it's a lot of spills. Can I have like six paper towels? That's not six paper towels, but thank you so much. Thank you so much. Jeremy's got his, uh, a cab sauve. Sauve? Cab sauve? Sauve. Sauve. Isn't, isn't that French? Sauve. This. That's so nice. Well, anyways, we are going to ramen and then, babe. Well, Patty the and then Patty the Batty is fighting tonight. We're gonna watch some UFC. Patty the Batty watched a lot. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, I, I thought so. Obviously a fan. And then, I think a couple glasses of this and Jeremy will in fact be joining for the advent calendar. Oh my God. Oh, chaotic start, chaotic start. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, we are in 4K today, baby, because Jeremy is pressuring me to shoot with higher quality. I'm pulling you in. We've got 4K and we've got all of our fancy lighting happening right now. But Jeremy is in fact wearing the same outfit as yesterday, so he refuses to be in the advent calendar today. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 10. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Everybody sit. That means you, Diggy. Diggy, that also includes you. Moose, that is a wonderful sit. No, no, no. Door's closing. Oh, that's such a good sit. Everyone wait. Nope. Nope. Ah. Okay. Diggy, no. Diggy, no. Diggy. 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 <laughs> oh. Okay. Gentle. Dig it. Gentle. Gentle. Okay. Hang on. Okay. Everyone, everyone, relax. <laughs> I saw someone in the comments say, oh my God, I love the advent calendar. I wish we did this on a daily, I wish it was a daily thing. Great news for you. <laughs> That's how advent calendars work and I'm so excited about it. Diggy sit, diggy sit. Good boy. That's so nice. 
nice. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 11.